I'm about to spend the next 72 hours eating only what I catch on a tropical island. I'm gonna have to pull out all the cards from under my sleeve just to survive. That includes boat fishing, shark hunting, and sea urchin diving. Stay along for the ride guys because it's gonna be a lot harder than I expected. All gone. I can't sleep. So we have to shower here. We're basically done. Oh. What the f Once I cross this gap over here, I won't have any outside food and I can't return to Singapore for the next three days. First things first, we have to catch as many fish as possible. In a few hours, the boat and our captain Iskandar will leave me behind on the island. So that means my best chance at getting food is right now. Upon reaching the first spot, I immediately rigged up my secret weapon for the day. Okay, we have Tenya and an Apollo here to maximize our chances. True enough, we got multiple hookups in the span of an hour. Go, go. All right, Tyler has fish on. Fallen. Tyler's first fish on. This is our dinner, bro. This is food for tonight. Oh, yeah. Oh. oh. Man, tusk fish. Perfect first fish. Dinner. This is gonna be dinner. Oh, nice. Bream. Oh, you got? Yeah, I got a nice reef fish here. This is actually quite good for eating. Oh. Up. Oh. Oh. Another bream. Another good meal for you. <laughs> well, we might have caught enough fish so that we don't starve. We certainly weren't gonna be feasting on a few reef fishes. We need some biggies. Oh, wow. Can like even pull this drag. Wow. Since we're so close to the island, we're gonna have to head there in just about one hour. So we have one hour to catch as much fish as possible, and the time starts now. The clock is ticking, and it was time for everyone to lock in. At the most crucial time, I felt something nibbling on my rod. Forever. I got, I got. Oh, tight and tight and drag, tight and drag. Hey, film, film, film. Well, I think I'm... What? Do I also have? Oh, I also have. Oh, guys, double hookup, guys. Hey, Tyler, film it. You film. Are you sure we're not the same thing? I think we might be on the same thing. Okay. Oh, shoot, shoot. Oh. Oh, coral trout! <laughs> the coral trout is just about the best fish you could catch here. And this particular fish was greedy. It took both my bait as well as Tyler's bait. So naturally, we both wanted to keep it. This one's mine. This one's mine, bro. Bro, it's my hook, bro. My hook. It's no, his, no, 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 his no, no. my dive. This one's my dive. Hey, but just now also got the other hook inside. Yeah. Luckily, our captain knew about my challenge and came in clutch. No, no wait. Hey, hang on. Hang on. You can't eat this one. Bro. Huh? bro. No, seriously, bro. Nah, bro. You see that? You know those blue lines? <laughs> it's not dots. They are lines. You can't eat it. Ah, poisonous. Yeah. This is the best fish you can catch out here, but now that we've convinced Tyler's poisonous, I get to keep the fish. The time was almost up, but I said, screw it. Why not just drop my bait down there one last time? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, fish on, fish on. Fish on, fish on. Oh, yes. Wait, record, record. Tyler, record. Oh. What the f***? Alright. Big fish on, guys. Big fish on. Wait, Tyler, is, my, my, is this one recording? Yeah. Alright. Oh my gosh. Big. Yeah. Okay. Alright, guys. Big fish on. Oh, wow. Can even pull this drag. Oh. Oh, what is this? Oh, oh, oh bruh. Bruh, pumper <laughs> fish, bro, what is this? <laughs> I don't think I need to tell you this. You can't eat the puffer fish. So all we could do is throw it back. It was now time to say goodbye to Tyler and Captain Eskandar, as well as the boat. And we're not going to have any boat for the rest of the two days. There goes our boat, guys. We are now stranded on the tropical island for the next two days. 
we won't have the boat that got us all our food for today. It's gonna get a lot harder from here on out. Let's go in. So this chalet has a barbecue pit, has a kitchen, has toilets, has aircon, has beds, and it's only for 30 plus Singapore dollars a night, and that's a steal. Let's try and open some lights. Oh, nice. 18 degrees, perfect. It's now time to settle in, go for a shower, and get some nice food. Guys, that's actually quite good. Good morning guys, it's officially the second day of the 72 hour challenge. Now we're gonna have to go out and catch the food for tonight or else we're gonna starve. We're not gonna have anything to eat. I have a few things planned, I'll tell you about them on the way. My trunk card was gone, I had no boat and I was in this all alone. What is the plan you may ask? I'm gonna set up a crab trap, the dead fish carcasses from the night before and throw it into the mangrove area where the crabs will crawl into the trap. I would then walk across the island to the coral reef and go for a nice dive, catching whatever I can set my eyes on. So with all that being said, it was now go time, we're gonna get ourselves some food for dinner. So the crab trap is here, and the bait that we have is the dead fish carcass, and then we also have some squid as bait. All I had to do was set up the trap, tie a rope to it, and go for a dip in some questionable waters. Our trap is set, we have to come back in a few hours to check on it. It's time for the real fun to begin. I'm gonna swim up to a coral reef at the other side of the island. If I can't catch a fish with a rod, I'm just gonna have to catch one with my bare hand. I can see urchins everywhere down there. I'm gonna go try and grab the urchin. Oh my gosh guys! We got our sea urchin. This guy's gonna make a great feast. I'm so excited. I didn't have the proper means to bring the urchins back, so I'm not gonna be able to catch any more. I'm gonna have to come back another day with more manpower. Okay, we are back at the crab trap. It's here. See if we got anything. No. Doesn't seem like we got anything. I've probably burned about a hundred urchins worth of calories by now. We need more food. I tried fishing all evening, hit multiple spots, but in the end I had nothing to show for it. After soaking at the chalet for a little bit and eating my hard earned urchin, I finally decided I was gonna do some shark fishing. It's night time at St. John Island, and that means the perfect time to catch some massive sharks. So let's get started. We have a big float here, leader line, wire leader down here, and then we actually have a big circle hook down here. First step is to just hook up some live fish. This bream that we caught earlier on Gupango Charters is gonna be the best bait we can find. Right, like that, and we're gonna cast this guy out. I felt a huge bite on my rod, is what I wish I could tell you. But the truth is, I caught shit. And not just that, I also sat there for hours, lonely. It's really hard to get in contact with anyone, text, let alone call, contemplating the whole challenge. I really wish we made it a 24 hour challenge instead of this 72 hours. This is the biggest letdown possible. I caught no crabs, no sharks, and I was gonna starve. I really don't know what we're gonna do. But the challenge wasn't over. We still have day three. And if Royang Fishing knew one thing, that would be that every failure is the perfect time to bounce back. We're basically done, bro. What is going on, guys? It's a bloody good morning. Today, my friends are coming over 
and we're gonna be doing some fishing, diving, for sea urchin, and then after that, once the challenge ends, we're gonna have a massive barbecue feast. So let's not waste any time, let me get to my workout first. Let's go say hello to the boys who are coming with us for the last day. It has been really lonely for the past few days. I feel so good having some company now. Oh, where pee pee? Okay, my dog is here as well. My plan is simple. Catching urchins will be way easier when I have five of my friends helping. Two can be diving, one person will be pulling a bucket up and down to fetch the urchins, and the other three can focus on catching some fish. All that was left to do was to set out and get started. Alright guys, perfect. Let's go catch some urchins. Six people fishing together is cool, but that also means we have six mouths to feed. If you don't want to starve together tonight, now is the time to make the change. This is Tiller Fish, yep, is preparing the rods. Sabiki and Apollo, and the other Tyler, which is Tyler Monkey, is trying to catch the urchins right here. We had a problem. The tongs we brought out today were too short. There was no way to get the urchins without our hands being collateral damage. I have a plan. The tongs don't work. We're gonna use chopsticks. <laughs> The chopsticks weren't easy to use, they were just big, flimsy pieces of wood. But seeing that I've been practicing for this all my life, I was able to pull it off. Oh, you can't, you have to hold <laughs> you so sad. Where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? Oh, yeah, well, that's oh, what big the hell? shit. Alright, <laughs> right. Bucket, bucket. But that was not the end of it. I still had to bring it to the bucket, and that wasn't necessarily easy. Hey, you're losing it! You're losing it! You're losing it! You dropped it! No, it's dropping. But the chopsticks are not working. Bro, these are Asian oh, jeans. Bro. You lost it, you lost it. You lost it. Dumbass. Right, it's falling, it's falling. It's falling, falling, falling again. Go. <laughs> yes. 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 We also got some success in the fishing realm. Uh, Constant is getting bites. Is there any fish? Oh. Oh, shoot. Oh. Gone? Oh. Oh, oh, oh. oh got a nice fish. <laughs> We have tasted our first bit of success, and now we have four hours remaining to hunt our dinner. Wait, what's that? Alright, correction, we have 15 minutes remaining to hunt our dinner. The storm was coming, and there was nothing we could do about it, except grind as hard as we could. Another urchin, here. We caught urchin after urchin. It was non-stop action. So Roy has caught the third one of the day. Sell this to like the sushi places, man. <laughs> like the, the sea urchin scheme, bro. <laughs> Wait, you wanna show? Can't wait to not do that again. <laughs> Here are the 10 urchins, 5 of mine, 5 of Tyler's. The rain was right on top of us. We had no choice but to return to the beach house. Even though the mission was cut short, it was still a successful mission. We managed to get all the food we need for dinner. After we took a nice shower to rinse off all the salt water, we went straight to making our dinner, starting by making a huge fire. Everything was wet due to the rain, so we all had to come together to get the fire started. So we made the fire, we're heating up all the coals, and then once we're done, we'll spread it out, pat it down, and then uh, put the mesh, the mesh over here on top and then cook our stuff. The challenge officially ends now. We are going to take our first bite of drumsticks, we had in so long. Slicks. Three, two, one, let's go. Bro does not know how to speak English. Mmm. Why is bro ravaging the food? There we have it, guys. We've successfully completed our challenge. We're gonna enjoy our nice dinner, and I'll see you guys in the next challenge.